So now I'm going to do a demonstration. Uh, I'm going to teach you theory and how we do it, why we do it. This is an ancient Indian technique, what we use. Um, so what you're doing is you're using the entire body weight on the client by massaging the body. And that that gives you so much deep pressure and it's like two hour deep tissue massage within 15 minutes. So you keep the person in here in the body and then you basically walk on the person. That's what you do. Okay. So now I will do the demo. I'm going to teach you two techniques. One with the frame, one using without a frame. Okay. Now you keep the frame underneath the uh, armpits, right? You see body. And you keep the foot on the sacrum itself, okay, and you rock. You work on the buttocks, pressure, and just say hello to the legs and the thighs, okay. Just gently rocking. And then you go to the calves, a little bit less pressure. Now, you do the buttocks, gently rocking. You keep the foot on the sacrum, okay, and you stand on the body, but don't put the weight, but you float, see, I'm floating now, and my feet should be together, not like this, if it's like this, then you slip, and then your hands should be like this, to strain your hands, so keep the feet together, on the sacrum, but without putting pressure, and slowly drop your weight, by relaxing your hand, and listen to the breath, and I'm also breathing with it. And slowly I'm releasing the tension from my hands. So I'm dropping my body. Now that's the edge. Can you see that? That's the edge. Yeah? Now I take one foot on the side of the spine and put my weight onto right leg and release the left leg and breathe. When you breathe out, you press. Now on the shoulder blade, I use my foot like this to press, stretch. On either side of the spine, not the spine. I'm going with the breath. Now I do the other side of the spine. Yeah. Now she can actually take a little bit more pressure. Now I'm going to go on tiptoes <coughs> on the lower back. Now I'm going to rock a little bit. Now I'm going to walk with both legs onto the upper body very quickly, not stay in the same place, and go back to the second. Got it? And then move the frame back now because we are going to do the lower back now. And then the upper thighs. And, and slowly increase the speed like this. Increase the speed. And then after increasing the speed, after a couple of minutes, stop in stillness. Many things happen when you are in stillness, not while you are doing things. So in this whole of the body work, you'll see a lot of the time in stillness. You start in the same place where you started earlier, drop the body a little bit, okay? Then you need to ground the person. So how you ground the person is with the foot. So how you ground the person is move the frame to this side, keep the frame here, and use your heel on their heel, and just massage with your foot, their foot, gently rocking. So that concludes that particular sequence completely. Okay. And then leave the person to relax a little bit. And then uh, I'll bring a glass of water. And then after that, once you finish, you give a nice hug. Okay. Okay. Give a nice hug. So now I'm going to show you another technique to use uh, without using a frame, but using really deep body work within about less than 10 minutes you can relax the client, okay? So for this, uh, you lie down. I'm going to use my buttocks to do the massage, okay? <laughs> and anybody has good buttocks, this will be asset for you because <laughs> it's extremely relaxing. For the receiver, extremely relaxing. It is true, yeah. So what you do is, you sit on the client's sacrum, okay? Sit on the sacrum, okay? If you lean forward, you put less pressure. If you lean backwards, you put more pressure. So if I am too, if the pressure is too much, she will hit the mat, yeah? There you are, hit the mat, okay? Okay, so now, how I would reduce the pressure is another way, is doing this. 
If I move my hands this way, then I can control my pressure. Okay? Got it? Okay. So now what you do is, the technique is this. You stay here and you rock the pelvis backwards and forwards. This doesn't cost any energy to me whatsoever. And then rock left to right. Okay? And then circular movements. This particular thing I'm doing looks very sexy, but it's very deeply relaxing. I'm putting deep pressure. Okay. Now you go to the lower upper back. Now you are actually on the spine itself. So this is fun. You have to work on the spine. Because buttocks is this shape, so you avoid the spine by sitting on the spine. And back with them forward. And then you go back a little bit to the upper body. Back with them forward. Is the pressure okay? Yeah. As I go upper back, I could put a bit more pressure. No, the shape of the buttocks like this, see? Oh, okay, got it. So by yeah. sitting, you avoid the spine. Okay. If you, if you do any other way, you're actually damaging the spine. So now after doing the upper back, now if you lean back, you can put more pressure. But I won't put. There you are. I can hear the sound. I reduce. So now I go again to the lower back. By moving like this, my body, I can reduce the pressure, see? Because I take the weight onto my hand. So leaning like this, you can reduce the pressure. So now, on the buttocks, you rotate. On the thighs, you do the same. Back push and forward moves. Go along the thighs. Avoid the back of the kneecap. Go to the calves with less pressure. Calves are very sensitive. So work on the calves. Yeah? And go right up to the ankle. Right to the edge. When you come to the ankle, it's quite painful, so you put less pressure. And when you finish one side, either you can go up this way and come down the other <coughs> way, or you can go this way down. Buttocks, you can massage circular movements, side to side, anything you want with your buttocks. It's very relaxing. <laughs> Both for the giver and the receiver. And then you go onto the buttocks and you massage buttocks. Okay, so this is lower. And after this again, side to side, backwards and forwards, circular movements. And then you go back to the sacrum again, where you first started. Side to side. I'm listening to the body, the breath, finish the session, okay? Now I move so that her buttock stays on my lower back. And then I line back down like this. And I completely surrender and rest and breathe. Mm. And then slowly come up, same as you started. And you get up. 